Hello! I have a new light that I got from Christmas, so I'm using it right now. I hope you guys can see the difference. And I have this mic too that I put on top of my phone. So I don't know if it's gonna make a difference or not, but we'll see. Happy holidays, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for coming back here. I can't wait to show you guys what I got. So let's get right to it. Today, I'm so excited to show you guys what I got from Sephora. Hey. But it's from Sephora, Sephora SG. So the price might be a little bit different or a little bit off. But I just rounded it up. So if you guys really want to find the actual price, you can just always Google it. First thing I'm going to show you guys is one of my favorites out of the entire Sephora purchase. It's gonna be Makeup Forever's Ultra HD Foundation. This is in the shade R220 and this is the best thing in the world. So this baby right here costs a whopping 2,830 pesos. But it's the best thing in the world. I swear when you put it on your face, you're flawless, you're perfect, you're everything. There's a bug. <laughs> <laughs> it's the fruit fly. Next! is gonna be, this is something I never bought before or I never tried before, but um, I'm really excited to try it. It's this Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Gel in the shade Soft Brown. I usually just use eyebrow pencil. I don't really put gel on top, but maybe this is gonna be a game changer. <laughs> this teeny tiny bottle right here is 610 pesos. I don't know if you can, if it's focusing. Here we go. This isn't the full size, this is the smaller size because I just want to try it first. Next up is a Fenty Beauty set that I got. The Fly Baby Mini Eye Primer and Liner Set. So I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I've never used eye primers before. I usually just use concealers to prime my eyes before I put any color. So that's why I was so excited to buy this because uh, this is not gonna be my first eye primer ever. So these are mini sizes. Again, I just really wanted to try. I don't know if I'm allergic or if it writes smoothly, so, uh, but I'm excited to try them. This set for both of these costs 1,460 pesos. It's a great deal. Get your set while they still have stocks. Next is, I wanted to try different liners because I just wanted to see if maybe there's something better than Kat Von D out there, but I stand Kat Von D until the day I die. But still, I, I'm willing to try different liners out there. And of course, I read the reviews first before I buy them, but this is one thing that I'm so excited to try. It's Anastasia's liquid liner in the shade black. This right here is 1,300 pesos. So excited to try this. And another liner I bought would be this Stila Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner in the shade Intense Black. It's a pen, it's an eyeliner pen here. There you go. And this right here is 1,120 pesos for this. Apart from that, I also bought again my Kat Von D liners. I bought two just to replenish my stock because this is what I use every single day. So I really need a lot of these in case I run out. So one of these costs 1,233 pesos. But I, again, like I always say in all of my videos, I swear by this, it's the best thing in the world. But can't wait to try the others. So we're done with the eyeliners. Next, I'm gonna show you guys the one and only palette that I bought. It's Zoeva's Opulence. You own everything palette. <laughs> so this right here has um, 10 colors, 10 shades. And all of them are shimmer shades except for one, which is a red shade. And I'm gonna show you guys because this is the reason why I bought this palette. Ta -da! Look at that. Shiny, shimmery. Oop. And as you can see, all of them are shimmer, like I said, and it's only the red one that's not. Can't wait to try Get Your Glory, this right here. Okay, so this palette is 1,600 pesos. Not so bad because I've already purchased a Zoeva palette before and the, the pigmentation and the application and the fallout's really great. So next up would be Ah, oh, this is something I've never bought before. I was never really into false lashes, but then 
it's something that I want to get into. It's something I want to learn how to put on myself because I know how to put it on others, but I have a problem putting it on myself. So I got myself Velour Lashes and this is what they call their Effortless Silk Lash Kit. It comes with the lash tweezers, lash glue, and a set of really, really pretty lashes that I... Ooh, that I can't wait to try. This right here is 1,800 pesos for all of these three things. So I can say that this is really a great deal. So if I were you guys, again, if this set is still available, get your hands on one of them. So at least you can practice. If you guys are wondering why I keep looking down, I'm sorry. I have a list here and I'm reading, sorry. I also got myself another pair of um, false lashes. This is Ardell Wispies. They're called Demi Wispies in the shade black. This is just 302 pesos. So I just wanted to practice first with maybe these before I you know, actually use the the lower ones because I think they're more, they look, they look prettier. Another thing that I never really got myself to buy or even use is lip gloss because I just feel like I don't look good with lip gloss or it's just weird on my lips but then you know I, I'm willing to give it a try and I saw um, Stila's Beauty Boss lip gloss here in the shade Synergy and it's for 1,220 pesos and I just wanted to give it a try maybe who knows who knows so that's all the makeup that um, I got. Next, I'm going to show you guys some of the tools that I got. It's not a lot, but I'll start with my favorite. Fenty Beauty's All Over Eyeshadow Brush, brush number 200. Let me just get it out of the box because of the glare. There's the front. And the brush looks like, ooh, it's still really glary. Okay, let me just take it out of the box. There's plastic! <laughs> wait! <laughs> oh my gosh, it looks amazing. Can't wait to use this little cutie. 1,400 pesos for this brush. Really fluffy. I've all also been using Fenty's foundation brush for the past how many months and it's really great so I can't wait to try this. Next is Fenty Beauty's makeup sponge. Ta -da. So it's the shape's a little bit different compared to the Beauty Blender. It has like a sharp edge. Joe, it's not focusing. Okay, this is how it looks like. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. There. Put it out of the plastic. Boom. So cute. So cute. So cute. And I accidentally got two of these. Because I wasn't really checking my bag, checking my cart. So it's okay, I'm just gonna give the other one to Joey. Joe! <laughs> one of these costs 1,000, so I got two. 2,000! For this, but it's okay. I'm gonna give it to Joey. It's not gonna go to waste or anything. Next, I had a Pink Beauty blender before, and then when I was washing it, I squeezed it too much. Oh, I shouldn't do that. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> I squished it too much and my nails like sunk deep into it and it bore a hole into my cute ass. No, don't say ass. Into my cute beauty blender and there's like a scar now and I I see it every day and my OCD just can't stand My OCD just really can't stand it and I just had to buy a different one. I didn't want to get the regular pink one anymore because the black is just really cute. So I got beauty blender, the beauty blender pro. It's a black one. And it cost me uh, 1,005 pesos for this cutie. Those are my tools. Next, I'll show you guys some of the skincare stuff I got, but it's just two things. Sephora Collections Organic Cotton Pads. ta -da. I just wanted to give it a try. I mean, maybe it's softer or I don't know, but they labeled this organic, so she bougie. For this set of pads right here, it's 154 pesos. Oh, it's 50 big huge square cotton pads okay and last in this sephora purchase of mine i think this is my favorite all one of my favorites would be the sd lauder perfectly clean triple action cleanser toner makeup remover okay so i was telling you guys that i'm allergic to literally everything right so i got to try like the sample bottle of this in my previous purchase and when I tried it, oh my gosh, it works like a charm, doesn't give me allergies, doesn't make me break out or anything. So I decided to get myself the full size one. So this right here is a whopping 
1,500 pesos, but I tell you guys, it's worth it. It's really, really amazing. So this is 1,500 pesos, but I love it. And it's, I think, my favorite thing out of everything here. So this ends my video right here. These are all the things that I purchased from Sephora SG. And again, guys, like I said, you can just always convert. And you can check Sephora PH whether they have the items online or not. And if if they don't, then maybe you can just buy them from outside. I don't know. I ho ho hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I want to thank you guys for coming back and taking your time to watch this video. I hope you guys enjoyed because I really enjoyed buying all of these. If ever you guys have any comments or suggestions, just comment down below. And don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button if you want to see more videos like this. And I hope I see you guys on my next one. Bye!